Last time on Pokemon Lyaea, our heroes explored around the new route. Cole wanted to catch a ton of Pokemon. Hey, cut her some slack, she wants to complete her Pokedex. Cole caught a Vulpix and a Smoochum. Meanwhile, Rick was struggling to get a Snorlax to move. Cole then played a flute to wake Snorlax up. However, the Wild Hatena lifted Snorlax up with its psychic power. Then, Cole managed to throw a Pokeball at it. But the question remains, will Cole catch it? So, you think it'll be caught? Only one way to find out. I did it! I caught a Snorlax! That's pretty lucky. Hey, look over there! Whoa. Another cave? Wonder what lies in there? I don't know. Oh, that cave right there? That's Munchlax Cave. Oh, hey Benson. How do you know that? Because that's where I caught my trusty Munchlax. <laughs> I was exploring this cave once. Everything was going alright. Well, until I saw the Mon Mashes torturing a helpless wild Munchlax. <clears throat> Every wild Pokemon is what Paul Wilders they do. We know that, you nitwit! I couldn't just sit back and watch. I had to do something. Blast Blastoise, use Hydro Pump! <laughs> Come on! Just fight all! Don't watch out, dude! <laughs> Let's make like Safari Zone Pokemon and flee! <laughs> mm. So sorry those thugs were terrorizing you, little fella. You should come with me. You'll be a lot safer. You saved Munchlax from the Mind Mashers? Yes. I'll join you in the Munchlax cave to make sure there's no suspicious activity occurring in there. This is giving me flashbacks to the Mountain of Mystery. Yeah, but they aren't the same cave. This cave is supposed to be a sanctuary for Munchlax in the Lyre region, as well as any other Pokemon that dwells this cave. Like Zubat? Yes, Rick. It seems like there can't be caves without Zubats in them. I hope the Mon Mashers here aren't causing any aren't here causing any trouble. That's why I'm here. To make sure nothing bad happens to any Pokemon in this cave. <laughs> Gee, it's starting to get dark in this cave. Rick's right. We need a Pokemon that can light the way. Does anybody have any ideas? Hmm. I've got an idea! Hey, Brixen, we need your help. You suppose you could light the way with the stick on your tail? <laughs> that sure is convenient. Wow! This cave is bigger than I thought. Rick, have you seen how big a Snorlax gets? I would know. I just caught one. We know, Cole. We know. Seriously? Are we ever going to find the exit? <laughs> Hatena, what are you doing here? Why do you keep following me? Hey, look, it's Rick! Uh-oh. <laughs> Honestly, Rick, whatever your last name is, we weren't expected to see you here. You dropped into the wrong place. You're insane. I know, what's this? Looks like a future piece of, piece of macrame. I could even use it for cleaning the inside of an oven. You're considered a Pokemon species. This thing looks more like a rejected candy mascot. What are you, some kind of Lisa Frank freak or something? Enough! No more of this insulting high tenant nonsense. You just messed up, bro. 
Well, what are you going to do about it? Defend that antenna. Go, Frogadier! <laughs> hey, I remember that, Frogadier. Benson, it just occurred to me. Rick is suddenly missing. Don't worry, Cole. I'm going to find him missing people. Maybe he's still back there a bit. Rick, where are you? Oh, Benson, we found him. What's he doing? Frogadier, use water pulse. <laughs> it would appear that Rick is defending a wild hatena from the Mourn Mashes. Okay, fine, you surrender. <laughs> Fled from a trainer with a water starter again? Seriously? <laughs> that should teach them from messing with this hatena. Hatena, you should probably come with me. You'll be safe from the Mon Mashers. <laughs> Welcome to the team, Hatena. Burner damp, burn dan dan, burner damp, burn dan dan. Burn a damp and a damp and a